Hey friends, hope you guys are having a great, great day. Today is December 31st, and tomorrow it's going to be 2023. In today's video, I'm going to attempt to ride every single ride here at Epcot before the new year. So hopefully, I get onto all the rides, and if you're new here, consider subscribing. Help me with the YouTube algorithm by smashing the thumbs up button and leaving a comment down below, and let's get started. So I'm at the first ride. This right here is uh, in the sea with Nemo and friends. And we're already down to a card. I forgot my magic band at home, but let's get to it. All right, before I walk in the line to go to Nemo and Friends, obviously I almost forgot that I needed to get a virtual queue. All right, I got my uh, queue. I'm guessing everybody else has, because everybody's sharing. All right, so it's 35 minute wait. First ride, the seas with Nemo and Friends. Probably hard for you guys to see, but this is the furthest I've ever had to wait for this uh, ride. Um, but it's part of the challenge, and this is the holiday crowd, so not surprising. All right, so the time is 1.13, so it took about 13 minutes to get on here. Alright, after going on that cute little ride, um, it's time to go to Living with the Land. Uh, that ride is a nostalgic one and also very educational, which brings you back to the days of Epcot of being an educational park, but it's one of my favorites here. Looks like there's a nice line for Living with the Land. I'm glad this ride is getting some love like it deserves. 20 minutes, let's see if it's actually 20 minutes. But I'm glad to see that this ride is getting some love here. Time is 1.36, so it took about 13 minutes. Nature has created a very different, but no less beautiful we've received from the land. Joy. Today, people around the world are... ...and shrimp, like the ones raised here, using our sustainable water systems. That's 85 minute wait for this. So it doesn't take that long. As you can see, I'm not in the regular line. It's actually kind of cool. Um, one of the cast members recognized me from being here before, and she actually said she watches my YouTube videos, which is pretty crazy because I'm not that big on YouTube yet. Which I'm hoping that 2023 is my year on YouTube. So to help me out, hit that subscribe button, like this video, and also comment down below if you had a crazy 2022 like I did. But 2022 marks the first year that I have lived in Florida for a full year. So let's say hello to a second year here at Florida. That's and of course, these little dudes. <laughs> actually one of the two cents that they use on the Avatar ride. Now in this scene is where you can see the first hidden Mickey. Which is right there. And then this is the second Avatar scent. It smells so good. There's the old Epcot. I wonder if they'll ever update it with the new Epcot. And here comes the second hidden Mickey. But that one's more obvious. Alright, so it has officially been one hour and I've just got off my fourth ride. Luckily for me, Epcot has just 11 rides here. So, there's all, like, seven more rides to go. With this crazy holiday um, lines, I'm not sure if I'll be able to get it done, but hopefully that I do. Uh, Figment is a 20 minute wait and starting to drizzle, so, which is the bad news, but hopefully we can get in there before it starts uh, really raining. 
But I think I'm doing good on time as of right now. But like I said, with these holiday crowds, it's, it's almost unpredictable. A little head Mickey right there. And just like that, our lift has arrived. Can't believe I'm on my fifth ride and it's only been an hour and 15 minutes. And just like that, here we go. And also, I only waited 10 minutes, not 20. But I am scared that it's gonna be pouring when we get outside. Here we go! Figment, you are not to interfere with the tour. You've got it wrong, Doc. It's not about listening with your ears. It's about listening with your imagination. Found your ears are hearing a thousand thoughts. Wonder where they're going to be doing the meet and greet for uh, Figment. So good news, it's not pouring yet. It definitely rained, the floor is wet. All right, so before I go to the Showcase Lagoon, I'm actually going to finish some rides over here. I have Mission Space. I'm also gonna get on Test Track before it starts to actually pour, um, because then that'll ruin my chances of completing all the rides, and I'm not sure how long the rain's gonna last. And then also I have to do Spaceship Earth. Oh, this is starting to feel overwhelming, but it's my first time doing this type of challenge. Uh, but we're getting it done. I hope you guys are enjoying this video so far. Appreciate it. Right now, there is a 70 minute wait, and even the single rider is pretty long right now. This is definitely the longest single rider I've ever seen. Alright, finally approaching our destination. I'm gonna get on here before it rains because we keep getting announcements that bad weather is coming in. Just like that, our lift has arrived. It's time to go. I'm so happy that we made it out there in time before it started raining because I don't want to get the new camera wet. Um, right now I'm going to head to Mission Space and then we're going to go on Space and Earth and then we'll see what we go from there. Alright so 15 minutes for the green and 60 minutes for the orange. I will go with the orange but well, let's head on. Alright after being on that I'm kind of disorientated. Uh, it's been a while since I've been on that. That's why I started always going on the green but for the video I went on the orange. Um, I did try to record in there, and legit, with all like the forces and stuff, I couldn't really even get a good angle. So I'm not sure if I'm going to include that in the video. But thank you, Mission Space. It's time for Spaceship Earth right there in the background. Oh boy, man, this looks crazy. Wonder what the actual estimated time is. But uh, I haven't seen lines like this in forever. A 25 minute wait. Uh, Let's, let's see if that's true or not. All right, we're finally making our way up. It was about 25 minutes to this point. So it'll be a little over 25 minutes just to get on the ride. And the this is definitely one of my favorite parts, seeing Earth in the distance as if we're on the moon. And then the descendant down hill could be scary for some. It was for me when I first came, ever came on here. But this is so beautiful. This is definitely trippy. But I love this part too, it's awesome. 
All right, the time is now 3.57, and I gotta get one of the biggest hurdles down right now. I gotta get Remy's Ratatouille Adventure. Then after that, I'll have three rides to go. The first one being um, Frozen Ever After, uh, Grand Fiesta Tour, and then also the best ride here at Epcot, Gardens of the Galaxies, Cosmic Rewind. France is definitely one of the most beautiful places here at the World Showcase. And also the home of the Remy's Ratatouille Adventure, which is the next ride we're going to. I'm scared to see what the wait time is. Wow, 135 minute wait. Uh, wow. <laughs> Good news, some bad news. Good news I got that ride out of the way. Bad news, it's starting to drizzle again and hopefully that doesn't slow us down. And also, hopefully I don't have to put this camera away. I got a zip lock, big freezer Ziploc bag just in case it does start to pour. I'm not gonna just use my phone. But the quality on here is a lot better and I wanna use this camera. All right, so here's the Grand Fiesta store. I've never seen a line over here before. Just to get into this building back outside just to get back inside once we get back that way. Like I said, this is the longest line I've ever had to deal with before. So we finally got in this area. <laughs> Alright, so we're all the way back here. The line is pretty long. It's time to go in the Grand Fiesta door. So you guys want to get in there. Here's one of those Mexican pyramids. I think it's called a Zot. One of these days, I want to eat here. I've heard they have really good food, so that'd be nice. And then back there, we have the nice active volcano. And now we're entering the cave to start the tour. <laughs> the guy in the center is missing. I don't know where he's at. Poor Donald is going to get swung at. Excuse me, have you seen a duck? Hey, hey, hey! The show's about to start. Now in this ride, there's about three or four hidden Mickeys. There's, I believe, two in this one room. I'll show you where those are at. So the first one is right here, as you guys can see. And that was the second one, and also that is the end of this ride. About 110 minutes later, we have finally made it in. Now we're about to head on here, Frozen Ever After. 
Stick your tongue on that. walking around the showcase I'm used to calling this the world showcase lagoon but now they call it the world showcase I'm not sure why they changed it I only got one ride to go but I obviously can't go on that until my boarding group has been called which is the gardens of the galaxy cosmic rewind uh, I can't wait to go on that it's gonna be awesome I did just run into Jojo uh, I didn't record but I am gonna head back this way so you'll probably see him in a second. So we're gonna be heading back this way. Jojo up there. So I have to get going. Some of the rides aren't so fun to get on because I either get dizzy or it's just boring. Um, but heading towards um, one of the best rides here, I'm very excited. And then after I get off this ride, I have to have uh, like a serious talk with all of you guys. And I appreciate everybody who's watching. Right before I get on this ride, I'm going to give you guys five seconds to hit that bell, subscribe, and hit that like button. Alright, so that's much appreciated. Thank you for doing that. Um, now let's get on the last ride here at Epcot. I am Nova Prime Irani Rea, Commander of the Nova Corps. On behalf of all Xandarians, I hope you have enjoyed exploring the wonders of Xandar. Assuming you had a ship that could fly at the speed of light. So we decided to come to you. But even we could not have reached you so easily were it not for the cosmic generator. And it I'm on. Someone needs to tell me when I'm on. Welcome, Epcot Terrence. You made it! Big, big man outside your ship. That is a big man. I need to alert no problem. I turns from the gods. This species has Awesome, I'm 
You really think they deserve to be called heroes? Did yes. you see how they dress? Welcome to the Guardians of the Galaxy! Alright, as always, that ride is on another level of excitement, G-forces, and just a great ride. It's like, it's all I want to do is to smile all day long after being on that amazing ride. So when we started this challenge, it started at 1 o'clock, and we ended it at 6.14. So I got all of that done in 6 hours and 14 minutes. Or is it 5 hours? I'm not sure. But, I got it done. That's all that matters. Just like that, the year is now over. 2022 is over, and so is my challenge. I got it complete. Hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Peace.